What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. Let's get right off into this, man. I'm going to keep it 100 with you, man. I see that Smack released his, um, Smack released his card. And in releasing his card outside, apparently, um, apparently in releasing that card, uh, Mike P on the card. Mike P going up against Kid Chaos. Think about that. Mike P battling Kid Chaos on Smack Outside card. Ain't that something? Will Mike P ever get to recover? You know that man ain't won a battle ever since he got exposed on the Ashley thing with Bill Collector. That man ain't won a battle since. Every battles he had, it's just been clear victories for the other opponents. That's like the most effective line in battle rap still to this day. Every time he's used against him, it's like it's brand new all over again. Nobody gets tired of the angle. People still want more of the angles. His emotions after the battles, after hearing the angles. And I'm telling you, bro, man, psychologically, this messing that dude up in the head. I don't even see why he even still wants the battle rap. And, and, and I could just imagine what they probably paying him for battle rap because his stock ain't growing. He ain't in high demand. Nobody cares no more. At one time, I know they were marketing and trying to push him to be the face for the white folk, to use him as a marketing tool, to you do the uh, demographics by which you bring in other, you know, nationalities inside of it to, you know, help the sales. But let's just keep it real, man. That man ain't been right since. I'm keeping it 100. That man ain't been right since. And it don't seem like that man is going to get right anytime soon. I don't think he could, I don't think he could recover from this. I really don't. It's too, too much, too much been said. Too many reactions out here. And it's like he's not even doing what he's supposed to do to turn that thing around and make it work for him. He come in sad face already knowing what's about to happen to him. When he come into them battles, his face tells it all. He already be looking like he defeated. He already be looking like, man, I don't stand a chance, man. I don't. He be looking like he about to cry. I'm keep, look, I'm keeping it 100. He be looking like he is about to cry. And I just don't see, I don't see it getting better for him. I'm keeping it 100. It don't. And I'm not just saying this. I'm keeping it 100. I really believe this. And the thing that hurt him most is that he never arrived. This is another reason why it's so damaging towards him. He never got to arrive. Like at one time, it seemed like, I ain't going to say he had a buzz. And I ain't going to say people was looking forward to hear him battle. But they gave him a chance. They don't give him a chance no more. Like the people really don't give him a chance no more. Now when he have battles, nobody expects for him to win. Nobody is looking forward to him winning. They just want to hear what the next opponent going to say about him and comparing it what the last person said about him. I'm keeping it 100. I don't see him in no type of way recovering from this at all. It ain't happened yet. I don't see it happening anytime soon. Now, the thing about Kid Chaos for the most part is he don't really do personals. He just rap a lot. But when you're going inside a battle like this, the name of the game is knowing your enemy, knowing what to use, and trying to take it the professional route may not be a good idea. If it ain't broke, don't try to fix it. If it ain't broke, don't try to fix it. This ain't the battle to take to try to go bar for bar with Mike P. You keep the ball rolling. If I'm battling Mike P, all I got is personals. 
All I got is personals. Ain't nobody coming to hear no bars. Ain't no, we want to hear some personals when you're going up against him. We want to see you make him cry. That's what the crowd should be saying. Make him cry. Make him cry. Make him cry. Make him cry. Kill somebody. Kill, because you know, he's white. Sometimes that serial killer kick in. You know, mostly all them white folks got a serial killer somewhere back there. <laughs> Make the John Wayne Gacy come out of him. <laughs> Make the John rap. Rap till he crack his damn cranium in the John Wayne Gacy come out of him. <laughs> <laughs> real hey kill somebody kill somebody you know them white folk they get to the beating their head because that serial killer trying to come out and they're talking to him let me out let me out let me out <laughs> and they transform into the serial killer. Yeah, that's who taught us how to serial kill. <laughs> they taught us how to serial kill. They just serial kill different than us. We call serial killer because we probably popped a few people. They do different. They, they serial kill different than us. They like to cut you. They like to eat you. They like to grind you. They like to keep you for a while. They like to sleep with the bodies and still play with them like puppets. They like to wear the skin. <laughs> they like to wear the skins. They like to kill the relatives. Like, they really be fighting their mama to death. Like, how you fight your mama to death? Who fight their mama to death? Like, you really fought your mama to death? Like, literally, you literally fought your mama to death. They do that type of stuff. They like to... They like to make you suffer. Black people just like to get it over with. Like, bang, is he dead yet? i give him another one. Bang, okay, he gone. White people different. They like to read the murder book. <laughs> All white folk got a murder book. <laughs> on the, the human body. They know how to calculate how long it takes for you to bleed out. They know how to make the pain so excruciating that you give in. They know which, which organ to eat first. <laughs> they know which organ to eat first. They, they study murder. They graduate murder. They know how to make things murder you. They know how to they know how to make make plastic murder you. <laughs> they know how to they know how to do that. They take the simplest thing. They know how to make the the top kill you. They they know how to use that top to kill you. They, they they can kill you. They they experts in killings. They can kill you with a feather. They know how to kill you with a feather. They can kill you with soft things. They know how to make the tissue kill you. They they experts in murder. They know how to they know how to trick your mind to believe. You ain't been murdered. <laughs> <clears throat> Bring that out in Mike P. Bring the serial killer out. Bring the bring that. He said he got that. He said he he said he almost killed himself a few times. He think. What'd he say here? Cat, what he call himself? The feline? He, he's something like a kitten. What well, didn't he say he a kitten or a, what did he say he a kitten or a cat? What is what did he say he was? 
So he almost killed himself a few times and didn't die. So he had nine lives. I think it's three, four of them left. He tried to kill himself like five times. I think it's it's four or five of them left. <laughs> Make him use a couple more. <laughs> Make him <laughs> Make him use a couple more. <laughs> Let's get him down to around two. Maybe he'll act right. Let's <laughs> let get him <laughs> let get him down to around, around his last two. <laughs> Oh, 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 get him down, get him down. <laughs> He's still trying to rap. Man, you're about, you're about to rap career over. You ain't going nowhere. Your stock going to keep going down, down, baby. Oh, stock get going down. <laughs> Give it to me now. Give it to me now. <laughs> Tell the raper man to do this. The stock drop. <laughs> no, you. You will never win another battle, man. I'm just keeping it one hundred. I ain't trying to post on. I'm just keeping it real. You will never. You will never win another battle. You're done. You're done, man. I'm just keeping it real. You done. <laughs> right now, you just getting picked on at this month, at this minute. And now <laughs> they cyberbullying you now. That's what it is now. <laughs> For real, it's over, man. I, I don't ever see you recovering. You can't recover from this. You're done. I, I'm keeping it one. You're done. I don't see you ever winning another battle ever again. I, I I just can't see it, bro. Anytime somebody use the angle, you're dead. Nothing else you say means nothing. Nobody cares. No believability. We only believe <laughs> you'll hurt yourself. <laughs> let's see. Let's see if we can get them down to two. <laughs> With that being said, it's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment lesson question. It's yours.